Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're going to test out some rodent traps that are named after Satan. These are the Lucifer Snap Traps. This larger one's for rats and the smaller one's for mice. These are made in France and the trademark Lucifer was first given to a company named Massey on November 7, 1929. These aren't the only traps with the name Lucifer. Here's a choker style. I'm going to test this one out in another video. Now what I like so much about these snap traps is the bait pedal. It's a long piece of wood with a bent nail as a hook. That way you can really secure your bait and the animal's more likely to get caught. There's a metal loop here for the lever, a powerful spring, and a kill bar. To set it, you pull this back, latch over the lever, and hook it in. You do the same with the mouse trap. The idea is you set these up in a place where you have rodents. They'll come along, want to get the bait, and you got them. Now I noticed that mice have moved into an old farm truck and in the barn we have rats. Let's go set these up with motion cameras and see if we can get a mouse and a rat with Satan snap traps. Last night I set up Satan's snap traps in the barn and they both worked really well. We got a rat and a mouse. Now I'm not going to show in this video removing them from the trap, giving them a little flip. And that's because there was enough going on in the videos, enough elements that have gotten me in trouble in the past with age restrictions, demonetization, and strikes against my channel. I do not want that happening. So on my website I'm providing all the footage of the traps in action, taking them out of the traps. And the elements that I'm talking about are this rat had a big parasite, a botfly maggot, and I removed it. I just don't want to show it on this channel. But I am really glad to get rid of a parasite infested rat and a mouse from a truck. If you've had mice in a vehicle, it's no good. They chew on wires, they pull out insulation, make nests, and they pee. It just stinks. So I'm really glad these traps worked. I'm posting between four and five rodent trap videos a week. So if you want to see how to catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, stay tuned.